Do you ever feel connected to someone? Like you know exactly what they're feeling, no matter how far apart you are? Well, you might not be too far off the mark if you consider your feelings on a quantum level. Today, we're diving headfirst into the quantum realm. We're going to talk about a phenomenon so strange, even Einstein himself called it spooky action at a distance. A concept that turned our understanding of reality on its head. Now this might feel like trying to learn a foreign language while juggling flaming torches, but don't worry, we'll get through this together. Imagine these two particles are you and your best friend. Now, if I interact with one particle, the other one starts giggling too. Crazy, right? Well, that's quantum entanglement, but on a super simplified kind of goofy scale. In the world of tiny particles, quantum entanglement is when two or more particles become inextricably linked. These particles could be photons, electrons, atoms, or even larger objects if we're feeling particularly adventurous. These particles interact in a way that their quantum states, essentially the particle's identity card, become intertwined. From that moment on, these particles are entangled. They're like conjoined twins. What happens to one immediately affects the other. And when we say immediate, we mean way faster than light. So, what does it mean for their states to be entangled? Let's consider an oversimplified scenario where we have two electrons. Electrons have a property called spin. But unlike a spinning top, electron spin doesn't mean it's physically spinning. Instead, it's a kind of intrinsic angular momentum, and it can be either up or down. When we entangle two electrons, we might not know the spin of either, but we do know that one spin will be up and the others will be down. They're in a superposition of states, which is the fancy quantum way of saying they're in both states at once. It's like flipping a coin. Before it lands, it's in a superposition of heads and tails. Only when it lands do we know the result. And here's where it gets truly mind-bending. If we measure one electron and find it in an up state, the other electron, no matter how far away, instantly collapses into a down state. The act of measuring one particle influences the state of the other instantly. It's as if these particles have a super quantum walkie-talkie, giving each other updates faster than light. But remember, this doesn't mean we can send information faster than light. Sorry, sci-fi fans. Quantum entanglement isn't just a simple action-reaction situation. It's a deep and fundamental correlation that exists between particles. And no, we don't fully understand why the universe allows it, but it's a reality we've observed, even if it does keep physicists up at night. This sounds more like the premise of a sci-fi film than something in our actual universe, right? Wrong. Welcome to quantum mechanics, where reality is stranger than fiction. Before we continue, we're happy to announce the sponsor of today's video, Brilliant.org, an interactive platform for learning math, science, and computer science. Their unique approach focuses on active problem solving with engaging courses, interactive quizzes, and daily challenges to keep your brain sharp. One of our favorites is the Physics of the Everyday course, which goes from everyday objects in the house to a variety of crime scenes. Join the brilliant community, monitor your progress, and hone your skills. Eager to fuel your curiosity? Sign up for free at brilliant.org slash cosmonology, and the first 200 subscribers get 20% off an annual premium membership. Click the link in the description to unleash your full potential. Now, let's uncover the wonders of science. Our story starts in 1935, when Albert Einstein, Boris Podolsky, and Nathan Rosen, known as EPR, came up with a thought experiment to show that quantum mechanics was, in their opinion, incomplete. Einstein himself wasn't a big fan of this weird, spooky action. He thought there must be some hidden variables that we were missing, but the universe had a different plan. Fast forward to the 1960s, physicist John Bell proposed a theorem that could test this spooky action. His predictions involved certain statistical correlations between measurements of entangled particles. Now, we've got a theory, a way to test it, but we need some brave physicists to dive into this quantum soup. And that's where our hero enters the stage, physicist John Clauser. In 1972, Clauser conducted experiments and guess what? The results showed that this spooky action seemed to be real. But as any good science fiction movie will tell you, there's always a catch. 
loopholes. All these experiments have them. And just like in a heist movie, the physicists are trying to close these loopholes to secure the quantum bank vault. Quantum entanglement isn't just a cool science fact for your next dinner party. It's the backbone of promising technologies like quantum computing and quantum cryptography. This tiny chip could revolutionize everything from weather forecasting to solving complex mathematical problems, all thanks to our spooky action buddies. Quantum entanglement shows us that at the smallest scales, the universe is deeply interconnected, profoundly weird, and beautifully unpredictable. And even though it can be as confusing as assembling flat pack furniture without instructions, it's part of the fundamental nature of our universe. When we're talking about quantum entanglement, it's like dipping your toes into an ocean full of mind-bending ideas. The ripples spread far and wide, leading to other remarkable theories and concepts. Anyone fancy a trip through a wormhole? Quantum entanglement may have a role to play in explaining how wormholes work. Wormholes, like those we love in science fiction, are bridges through space-time. They're shortcuts, potentially linking different universes or distant parts of our own universe. As romantic as it sounds, like long-distance cosmic pen pals, we haven't figured out how to send any love letters or anything else through them. But some physicists propose that wormholes are essentially pairs of entangled black holes, just when you thought things couldn't get weirder. This idea comes from the ER equals EPR conjecture, where ER stands for Einstein-Rosen Bridge, another name for wormholes, and EPR represents our friends Einstein, Podolsky, and Rosen. So, in a twisted turn of events, Einstein's spooky action might actually explain wormholes, a concept he co-authored. And as if traveling through wormholes isn't enough, entanglement also leads us to the concept of quantum teleportation. No, it's not like beam me up Scotty in Star Trek, but it's pretty darn close. In quantum teleportation, we're not physically moving anything. Instead, we're transferring the information about a quantum state from one place to another instantaneously. Don't worry, no physicists were harmed or vanished in the making of this discovery. Remember, these concepts are incredibly simplified. The full reality is even weirder and more complex. As for recent news, just months ago, physicists at Brookhaven National Laboratory have discovered a completely new type of quantum entanglement. The scientists on this new study pushed it to the limit and took a closer look at photon correlations, revealing a new form of quantum entanglement. The research team examined the patterns of many photons emitted from an atom and discovered a striking many-to-many -many correlation. This means that not just one, not two, but a whole group of photons are entangled with one another. It's like a group chat where everyone's on the same wavelength, literally. Quantum physics never ceases to amaze us, does it? This groundbreaking work is like adding a new chapter to our quantum physics book. It opens up new ways to study the quantum world and might even lead to more robust designs for quantum computers. These concepts may sound surreal. They might even give you goosebumps. They certainly do for me. But they underscore the power and beauty of scientific exploration. So next time you look at the stars, remember the strange dance of entangled particles. Remember the potential shortcuts bridging cosmic distances. Remember the prospect of teleporting information in a blink of an eye. Behind every flickering starlight is a universe filled with mind-bending mysteries, waiting for us to unravel. And remember, we're all stardust. We're all entangled in the same cosmic story. Isn't that something worth pondering when you gaze up at the night sky? Don't forget to watch the video on the right and subscribe. Thanks for being part of Cosmonology.